Hi, I'm Anthony. I'm an owner of a web design company, and uh, I give Story Express a 5 out of 5. Primarily, I use Loom for a lot of my video recording and sending to, uh, to customers and clients to be able to uh, help them with web design. Um, and it just wasn't really getting the type of quality that I needed for. Uh, so that's why I switched, switched over. I picked Story Express uh, for, for multiple reasons. Um, they're really similar with a lot of the other competitors that I was using as far as communicating with uh, clients and with customers, but the white label branding was a lot better to use. Um, they're continually expanding with a lot of their features, which I get regular updates on, and overall their support's really, really useful um, in those circumstances that I just needed a little bit of help. So I'm really happy with Story Express. So onboarding um, and integration as far as Story Express is concerned was really easy. I didn't really have hardly any setup. Uh, they just make it so simple just by installing certain extensions for your browsers um, and they allow offline and online support as far as the video formatting. It is just really easy to get initially set up. Um, I'm a one-man team and so I really have to rely on the simplicity and being able to manage these type of uh, resources effectively in my operations and it just integrated flawlessly within uh, my business. For me, uh, Story Express is definitely something that I would recommend. I went through a lot of different variations of seeing what tools would work for my business and what wouldn't. Um, I really decided with Story Express uh, ultimately just because of both it's more cost effective for my business model and the use of it was just so much easier. Uh, so I, I'd encourage anyone just to see what's out there, look at the competitors, uh, and see what fits your business model. But for me, it was Store Express.